My grandfather came to America at 17 years old in 1930. Grandfather knew that the weather in LA was very similar to the weather he grew up in in Piopo, Sicily, and wanted to relocate to Los Angeles. They drove across country. They found a bakery uh, at Third and Rose Street in Venice Beach. Pizza was non-existent in LA in the early 50s. And Grandpa started making pizza and going out and showing it to restaurant owners and teaching them the proper way to make pizza and not only how to cook it, but also how to serve it. We have a picture here that was taken in 1943 of my great-grandfather here on the left, my grandfather at the oven, and my uncle. And what they're doing is they're making pizza crust. And I would estimate that their output of pizza crust here probably could have been in the range of maybe 500 pizza crusts a day. Uh, today we're manufacturing frozen pizza dough and pizza crust and we can make as many as 500,000 pizza crusts a day out of this facility. He is truly a family owned community based business and it's that spark and that drive to maintain that in his business that has filtered through and down to our customer at Whole Foods who is so concerned with supporting small businesses, family-owned businesses, and local businesses because they know they're, they're not only helping people, but they're getting a, a really great, unique, superior product um, because somebody cares, not just a corporation cares. So what Kim brings to the table is that she knows the customer. She knows what the customers in her stores are looking for, what they want. And when she conveys that information to me, I throw my R&D hat on, get downstairs in the factory and start creating products that are going to fit that bill. The, the products that are made in Whole Foods are no different than what we're doing here in this pizzeria. It's just done on a much grander scale. So the, the most important thing is that if we have a customer who goes to a Whole Foods store in California or Arizona or Nevada, they know what they're going to get is that great Whole Foods pizza and it's consistent across the board. Eight years ago, uh, a doctor friend of mine in Santa Monica told me that she had proven that through a gluten-free diet, the behavioral patterns of the autistic children she was working with were improving. And that was really all the inspiration I needed to set out to create the world's greatest gluten-free pizza crust. And today it's one of the fastest growing segments of our business and has been uh, a product that has uh, brought the company more life and, and actually even reinvented Venice Baking Company. If you like thin crust pizza, you will love this gluten-free product. And in fact, all we hear time and time again is are you sure this is gluten free? That's all we hear. So, what I did was, I made this shirt. <laughs> I'm the third generation pizza maker in this family, and uh, we'll hope it can continue on to four generations.